Hey guys, I am Rizzy and today's video I will make some scenes of Spider-Man into the Spider-Verse and with a different suite of the movie. So first of all I need to say that I'll use a rig of someone I don't know but the link for this rig is on the description so if you want to download it I need to give the credits you know. And I'll start going to Blender and bro to be honest my, my knowledge on Blender <laughs> isn't the, the best okay. So for this first one I want to make like a, a, a really high beauty you know. And I will make that scene that he is sitting on the wall, like looking down, and you know. And I want to make kind of the same concept, but it's kind of I don't know. I, I want to make some something like <laughs> you see. So I need to to start to make the beauty. <laughs> I don't know how to make it. Well, I'll check some tutorials on YouTube and just copy that. So let's put some slices here. Now let's extrude this in. Oh, well, it's kind of it's getting the shape. Let's use this array modifier to make a lot of them. Let's make some materials here to to paint the window. Make some bevel to make the the edges more more smooth. Now here we have uh, a lot of windows. So duplicate this and rotate 90. Now let's use a mirror modifier. Adjust it all a bit. Now let's just use another array modifier to make it high. Well, I didn't record a part of the shading because <laughs> it was so difficult, bro. And to be honest, I I forgot to, to start recording, but it should be just painful to watch. So I have Miles here. I'll make some pose to him right now and I adjust the camera on the, the right angle. <laughs> bro, <laughs> bro, look at this. Bro, I don't know why, but he's remembering me uh, like a, a frog, you know. So I got this, this environment texture and... Well, I, I trying to make some light here. Now let's just adjust some other things. I, I want to make like the the windows more seen, you know, because there's there's not that edge there on the window, like the reflection is just bro, I don't know. Bro, I think that it'll be something like this for now. I just need to, to make this transparent and render it. Bro, I'll start with the sky that I use it for the blender, and it will be like this, I think. So I got this liquify. I want to change some things like his neck here. Bro, I, I don't like this render that much to be honest, but that's that's what I have, so I need to use it i i don't really know how to to make like 3d stuff so i think i will erase the hand too i need to paint his finger there and just try to to raise here i want to paint some shadows there i think here and here and make like that same thing here and just paint here i'll just paint like this i should make some shadows there because it, it's kind of visible too maybe it was easier if i if i knew how to to change those shadows on blender but i don't know how to use 3d so i'll make there so i have those buildings here now I'll just make some buildings now let's just drop this one behind everything make it a lot bigger and now i'll just copy this and make some more buildings so let me see how it is i'll maybe make this more like that well the color is kind of matching because well i use it the the same environment it, be, it needs to be more bluish so for the color correction it should be uh it should have more contrast i think and now have less greenish and more blue of course and now for saturation it should be well it should be kind of a little bit more maybe now i finish the compositing and i'll try to to make this all looks <laughs> a little bit beautiful so i think it should be kind of brighter down there contrast is is always a, a nice option so so now i should make some correction on the gamma so the image it's it's kind of better now because i have we have like a depth going on I, we have some some distance of the images so let's make some exposure there now I just make some things like this so i think it's this for now i need to make some some highlights there
some shadows just to make things more more dramatic, you know. Well, it makes the things like well, I don't know. I think it should be more more dramatic. I don't know if it will work, but I want to make some some things here on the those those spiders. And now I'll just make some hazy some some light some bloom, and I'll see how it will be. Oh, it's looking nice. I will just make some thing here too. Now I'll make some final glows. Well, it's time to make some blur. I think the blood is nice, bro. I just don't don't like the texture of this building because bro, it's too messy. So I think that now it's time for a camera roll. So that one is finished, and I kind of I kind of like it because th there is a like a concept of blue and red and a lot of glow. You know, I I kind of like it this one. So the next one will be a speed art because I wasn't able to talk while I was making this, so it will be a speed art. So for the blender, it's just the same process. I just pose it a bit, and now I just drag the render to Photoshop, and well, you can see the speed art. Thank you. 
Pixar is painted, so I kinda like this. I don't know what I prefer because it's kinda two different vibes, you know. But I like this one too, like the moon, and, and I just I like the compositing of this. So that's it for today, guys. Thank you for watching until now. I hope you like this video. Please subscribe my channel and leave a like down below. And follow me on Instagram if you want to see some more arts and those things. I'm really more active there. That's it, and I'll see you next time.